Hi, welcome to day four, A Miracle Mindset. So day four, the A in miracle stands for affirmation. Do you know how important the words are that you speak? So in the Bible, it says that the power of life and death is in your tongue. Do you think about the words that you say out of your mouth? Do you think about how much power you are producing? And do you think about the words that you say to yourself about yourself? See, many of us, the thoughts that we allow to hang out in our minds about us, we would never say that to other people. And we certainly wouldn't tolerate someone saying it to us. So today I want you to get used to creating a mindset that produced loving words for you. I want you to learn how to speak life to yourself. And so what we're going to learn to do and what you're going to learn to do is you're going to learn to begin to affirm who God says you are. So God says that you're valuable. He says that you're fearfully and wonderfully made. He says marvelous is his work. It's like you are his work and you are marvelous. But you got to get to a place where you believe that. See, what's interesting about us as humans, we do not have in life what we want. We have in life what we believe. So whatever it is you believe about yourself, you're living that out. If you believe that you're limited and you know there are things that stopping you from being all that you can be and that life isn't fair and that everyone around you gets to have something and you don't, then you will produce the energy and the thoughts and the choices that create that real for you. So as you begin to affirm for yourself what is true, what is loving, what is kind, what is pure, and be intentional about it every single day, your thoughts will begin to align with this new affirmation that you have for yourself. Listen, I'm not telling you something that I don't do and live every day. At the core of me, the old me, the part of me that used not to be awakened, the one that had believed that she wasn't enough, the reason I created these t-shirts that I am enough, is because that had to become my affirmation. It had to become something that I had to say to myself every time I wanted to do something that scared me. I create these different affirmations that I say going into certain situations. I used to be so afraid to go into a room with people that I didn't know. And to be honest with you, I used to be afraid of being in a room full of people who didn't look like me. But now that's not a problem because I affirm my way out of that through my thinking. There was an affirmation that I would do every single time I had to enter into a new situation. And now it's just become the natural part of me where I just walk in and I show up fully the amazing person that God created me to be. And you have that same amazement inside of you, but you have to affirm it. So in this program, on your worksheets, I hope you guys are doing the worksheets, don't just watch the videos, is a list of affirmations. I want you to go through that list and I want you to find the affirmations that speak to you. I want you to find the affirmations that you need so desperately in your life, that you need to learn to, so that you can like shift your mindset about you. And I want you to put these affirmations somewhere where you can read them every single day. And during your Miracle Mindset morning routine, in the, morning, in the beginning when you are meditating, then you take and you imagine by looking at your vision board. And then you realize that just by doing this, you're taking responsibility for your life. And then take time, put three minutes or five minutes on your clock. And I want you to speak those affirmations out loud during this time of your morning routine. And here's what's important about affirmations. You must choose the ones that you truly believe. If you are, let's say you pick an affirmation that says, I, I'm a millionaire. And you don't speak it like you're gonna have it. I'm going to be a millionaire. You speak it like you already are. If you pick the affirmation that says, I'm a millionaire, but you have a, whole, a deep belief that I'm, money is bad or I'm not supposed to have money or rich people are, are evil, know that that's never gonna come true for you because you have two beliefs that are in conflict. So make sure you're choosing affirmations that you deeply believe and that you want for yourself and that you believe that you can have. And as long as you believe you can have it and you continue to affirm it, you will. And this is how you begin to experience those miracles because you're shifting who you believe you are through your affirmations. So have at it, check out those affirmations and get intentional about choosing your affirmations so that tomorrow morning you can begin to practice that part of your routine.